excited because Jesus is here. Amen. Before we, any one of us could come here or gather, He's there preparing us in our hostel rooms, interacting with us, eagerly bringing us into a place of fellowship. Amen. That is the beauty of my Jesus. Yes. So we will worship Him. We will honor Him. We will lift Him up. And we will rejoice with Him. Yes, yes. Let's let's start with a word of prayer. Let's surrender ourselves before God. God is good. He's worthy. He's worthy. Father, we thank you. King Lord Jesus, we worship you for you are so good. For yours is the kingdom, yours is the power, yours is the glory, for yours is the dominion. We thank you for you are alive and you are present among us. Thank you for this beautiful resurrection day that has changed the history of humanity. Thank you for the cosmic effect that it has, it has created and as we are here to meditate and to ponder and to relish this day that has changed everything in the human history. Holy Spirit, we ask you to guide us, we ask you to lead us, we ask you to nourish us with the revelation of Christ and the risen Christ who is in us. Let your presence govern us. Even as we worship Holy Spirit, we do not know how to worship. Could you please lead us in worship? Connect us with the heart of the Father and the Son. Glorify Christ in us and for us and through us. Let the glory of resurrection, who is Christ, manifest in this whole city, across the globe as the people of God have gathered and are worshipping. We pray that this resurrection power, this resurrection life that we have received in Christ will flow through the body of Christ to everyone around us. Let your glorious presence take over. We give you glory, honor and praise. In Jesus name we pray. Amen and amen. Amen. Shall we all rise up? Give glory to God. Hallelujah. God is so good. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord, everyone. First of all, happy Resurrection Sunday to everyone. Amen. Right? So, our God is supposed to be worshipped. Right? So we are going to worship song, Lord, the who created everything with these sad faces. As you shakle leke permission ko mahima de ne aayo. Where is the happiness? Where is the joy? Because our Lord has risen today. Amen. He completed everything. We have hope because He is risen right now. Amen. He is supposed to be worshipped from every nation, from every tongue, every generation to generation. Right? supposed to be worshipped. He's the greatest amongst the all. Right?
days in our in our belief systems which we have he came he did his work now what what was left with us what 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 came to me and what jo mere paas aaya jo mere paas mere ko mila kal prachan what i thought on it was on meditation hindi mein kehte hain manan wo keh raha tha ki manan करते जाओ करते जाओ जब तक आपके अंदर की पिक्चर बदल नहीं जाती अंटिल एन अनलेस जब तक आपका हृदय मानने को तैयार ना हो जाए कि हाँ वो है और क्या था पीपल पीपल आर ऑलवेज लाइक दे कीप ऑन आस्किंग कि यार हम दुआ कर रहे हैं कर रहे हैं यार पर जवाब ही नहीं आ रहा हमारी जिंदगी में इतनी प्रॉब्लम्स है इतनी प्रॉब्लम्स है कि वी वी आर आर नॉट गेटिंग द आंसर्स ऑफ आर प्रेस पर दिक्कत ऐसी ये है द प्रॉब्लम इज दैट वी हैव प्रेड सो मच अबाउट द प्रॉब्लम्स प्रॉब्लम 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 दैट वी आर फिल्ड आवर हार्ट इज फिल्ड विद प्रॉब्लम्स सो इवन दो वी गेट आंसर्स बट वी सी आवर सेल्स विद प्रॉब्लम ओनली सो वो कहता है meditation manan if you manan if you do meditation the what the word does is that it will change your it will change your proclamation what you proclaim about yourself first it will change your heart because what i will see is we are see ourselves filled with problems even though if it's not solved if even if it's solved we see ourselves only filled with problems but his word always proclaims that no matter what happens keep on meditating proclaiming us kyunki everything is fine in the name of jesus proclaim his word day after day and no matter what happens then you see 
first of all your heart what your the problems in your heart what do you think it will go off and vanish see having problems in your heart is different than having problems in your body the problems in your body might go off but if you don't think the problems in your heart they will never they will never leave you no matter what happens and he is a king of kings as we know he is the lord of us and all the problems which we had in our life all the situations which we going he is already solved for us there is nothing in this world that he has not gone through that man has ever been anxiety suffering i think he is the only one who has gone through a lot the peak level of all these sufferings and anxiety is has been faced by jesus himself amen but he has overcome it and he says that if i can do so then why can't we do so so this is a very and as we know that he's use kehte hain he's a king of kings rajaon ka raja yeshu raja aaye gaate hain gana bada hi pyara gana hai rajaon ka raja clap clap zero clap राजाओं का राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा हरे गुया हरे गुया उसका धन्यवाद करो राजाओं का राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा धन्यवाद करो लाइट वेरी लो लग रहा ना लेट्स लेट्स लेट मी जस्ट इंक्रीज लेट्स गो टू राजाओं का राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा हालेलुया हालेलुया उसका धन्यवाद करो राजाओं का राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा हालेलुया हालेलुया उसका धन्यवाद करो करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो यहोवा का धन्यवाद करो क्योंकि वो भला है उसकी करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो राजाओ परा जाए राज करेगा हाले लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो राजाओं का राजाओं का राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा हाले लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो धन्यवाद करो उसकी करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो जो ईश्वरों का परमेश्वर है उसका धन्यवाद करो उसकी करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो राजा यीशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा हाल लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो राजा 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 यीशु राजा जगत में 
राज करेगा हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो ओ राजा ओ का राजा ये राजा जगत में राज करेगा हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो राजा ओ का राजा ये जगत में राज करेगा हाल लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो यो का धन्यवाद करो क्योंकि वो भला है उसकी करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो का धन्यवाद करो क्योंकि वो भला है उसकी करुणा सदा की है धन्यवाद करो राजा हो का राजा यशु राजा जगत में राज करेगा उसका धन्यवाद करो हाल लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो हाल लुया हाल लुया उसका धन्यवाद करो जगत में आया रहे वो लोगों के दिलों में ऐसा फंस गया कि लोग उसके लिए जान देने के लिए तैयार थे पत्रस ने तो कान काट दिया था और पीपल ऑल डिसाइपल्स इफ यू सी इन दर कॉज दे नेवर हैड अ पीसफुल डेथ एवरी वन वॉज परसिक्यूटेड टू डेथ एंड सफर्ड डेडली डेथ इफ यू सी John the disciple, इसके तो we don't have any records of him. He's whether alive or dead. But still, his mercy lives. उसका प्यार ही काफी है आपका जीवन बदलने के लिए. Amen. एक बड़ा ही जबरदस्त गाना है. ये है. तुम दिल में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए. आइए गाए. बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए जीवन में ऐसा काम कर गए और पाप मेरे शाप मेरे चलते बन गए तुम दिल में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए जीवन में ऐसा काम कर गए पाप मेरे शाप मेरे चलते बन गए में आंखों में तू है दिल में जा में होटो में आंखों में तू है और दिल में जा में होटो में आंखों में तू है और दिल में जा में होटो में आंखों में तू है दिल दिल में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए जीवन में ऐसा काम कर गए और पाप मेरे शाप मेरे चलते बन गए और तुम दिल में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए जीवन में ऐसा काम कर गए पाप मेरे शाप मेरे चलते बन गए और जाटो में आखो में तू है होटो में आंखों में तू है होटो में आंखों में तू है दिल में जा में होटो में आंखों में तू है जो 
जी रहा था घर से मुझको यीशु ने खींच के निकाला तस्वीरों में जो झगड़ा हुआ था तोड़ कर उनको आजाद है किया डर डर के मैं जो जी रहा था डर से मुझको यीशु ने खींच के निकाला तस्वीरों में जो झगड़ा हुआ था तोड़ कर उनको आजाद है किया तुम दिल में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए मन में ऐसा काम कर गए अरे पाप मेरे शाप में चलते बन गए में ऐसे बस गए जिंदगी भर के लिए राजा बन गए जीवन में ऐसा काम कर गए पाप मेरे शाप मेरे चलते बन गए प्रभु के रूप में नहीं बनाया गया था ही वॉज नॉट मेड इन द इमेज ऑफ गॉड एंड ही डजन उसके मुंह में जीवन और मौत नहीं है ही डजन हैज द पावर ओवर डेथ और लाइफ सो ही कैन नॉट कंट्रोल एनी थिंग वी वर मेड इन द इमेज ऑफ गॉड एंड फ्रॉम आवर माउथ वी हैव अथॉरिटी ओवर डेथ एंड लाइफ मैन इन द नेम ऑफ जीजस वी कैन गिव अ पर्सन वी कैन इन द नेम ऑफ जीकन वी कैन मेक एनी थिंग पॉसिबल through our mouth if we declare in the name of jesus Amen. and this thing he knows satan knows his very well because he cannot do it but at the same time he is well aware of this he has no right over anything and he knows it very well now the question comes here is that now what he does is that he he gives symptoms to us like uh, symptoms he gives There was a man, there was a man who said that. अरे ऐसा लग रहा है heart attack आ रहा है. अब शैतान क्या करेगा? शैतान करेगा पकड़ 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 इसे पकड़. इसने अपने मुंह से अंगीकार कर दिया कि इसे heart attack आएगा. Heart attack आ अभी आ. He gives symptoms. This is how we are caught in the death, under death. This is how he works. The thing is, Satan is. well aware of everything he is a very good person he and he he is a very good scholar of bible jitna hum jante hain bible ko usse kahi guna zyada he knows everything about bible the thing is ek baat yaad rakhiye aap ki duniya ka koi bhi aisa 
हथियार नहीं है जो शैतान को हरा सके दे इज नो वेपन इन दिस वर्ल्ड इज विच इज मेड टू डिफीट ही कैन नॉट बी डिफीटेड इजिली वचन ही की एक ऐसी तलवार है जिसका सर धड़ से अलग कर सकती है आमीन वचन में ही एक ऐसी ताकत है जो उसकी जान उसके दिल को चीर सकती है तो मनन करना मेडिटेशन इज वॉट इज वेरी मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंट जो बहुत ही जरूरी है Let the king of my heart be the mountain where I run be the shadow where I hide Let's do it again please be careful with the lyrics don't play with the lyrics let's go with the song properly okay So if you don't know the lyrics let's go ahead with the lyrics theek hai let's all worship together Let's do it again Let the king of my heart Oh he is my song let the king of my heart be the fountain i drink from Oh he is my just worship it's okay you are good good oh you are good good oh Let's do it again. Let the king of my heart be the mountain where I run, the fountain I drink from. Oh, he is my song. Let the king of my heart be the shadow where I hide, the ransom for my life. Oh, he is my song. You are good, good. Oh you are good good oh you are good good oh you are good good oh sing it again you are good Let the king of my heart be the wind inside my sails the anchor in the waves so oh, he is my song let the king of my heart be the fire inside my ways the echo of my days so oh, he is my song you are good good oh The Go. king of my heart be the mountains where I run the fountains that I drink from is my song let the king of my heart 
Be the shadow where I hide The ransom of my life Oh, he's my soul You are good Oh, oh you are good You are good Oh, you are good You are good, good. Father, we worship you You are good, you are good. You are good, good. Oh. We might go back, but the love of God keeps us steady and strong. Amen. The love of God makes us steady and strong. Hallelujah. We worship you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Let's sing this song. Can you get me the lyrics of this song? I'm no longer a slave to fear. When Jesus has conquered sin and death, the fear of death is broken. Amen? In the history of mankind, nobody has conquered death there's only one person his name is Jesus we'll worship him I'm no longer I'm no longer a slave to fear I am a child of God I'm no longer a slave to fear I am a child of God From my mother's womb You have chosen me And love has called my name I've been born again To your family and your blood flows through my way from my mother's womb from my mother's womb you have chosen me and love has called my name I've been born again and I've been born again and to your family Your blood flows through my way. And I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am a child of God. And I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am a child. child of God. Yes, I am. I am a child. 
child of God. Let's declare that I am. I am a child of God. Sing it, I am. I am a child of God. I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am a child of God. I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am a child of God. So here I am to worship. Here I am to bow down. Here I am to say that you're my God. Just worship Him. All together, lovely. All together, all together wonderful to me so here i am so here i am to worship here i am to bow down here i am to say that you're my god you're all together lovely all together worthy all together wonderful to me so here i am so here I am to worship, here I am to bow down, here I am to say that you're my God, you're all together lovely, all together worthy, all together wonderful to me. Sing light of the world, light of the world. You step down into darkness, open my eyes, let me see beauty that me, beauty that me, this heart adore you, hope of a life spent with you. Let's remember the light, light of the world, you step down into darkness. Open my eyes, let me see Beauty that made this heart adore you Hope of a life spent with you So here I am So here I am to worship Here I am to bow down Here I am to say that you're my God, you're all together lovely, all together worthy, all together wonderful to me. So here I am to worship, here I am to bow down, here I am to Oh, you are my God, all together lovely. Together, wonderful to me. Thinking of all this, King of all days, oh, so highly exalted, glorious in heaven above. Humbly you came, humbly you came to the earth you created. All for love's sake became poor. So here I am to worship. Here I am. We bow down before you, my King. Here I am to say that you're my God. You're all together lovely, all together worthy, all together one. Full to me, so here I am. So here I am to worship, here I am to bow down, here I am to say that you're my God, you're all together lovely, all together worthy, 
all together wonderful to me. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all His benefits. Bless the Lord, for He forgives all your sins. Bless the Lord, for He heals all your diseases. Bless the Lord, for He has redeemed you from the corruption. Bless the Lord, for He has crowned you with glory and honor. Bless the Lord for he has separated my sin from me as far as the east is from the west. Praise the Lord for the new covenant for he will remember my sin no more. Bless the Lord for I have been made a new creation. Old is gone, the new has come. And bless the Lord for he has exalted us and seated us together in the heavenly places right at the right hand of the Father. Shall we sing this song? Bless the Lord, O my soul, and just worship Him. Worship the risen King. Hallelujah. The sun comes up. It's a new day dawning. It's time to sing His song again. The resurrection song. The victory song. And I will bless the Lord at all times. Amen. The sun comes up. It's a new day dawning It's time to sing your songs again Whatever may pass and whatever lies before me I will be singing when the evening comes Bless the Lord of my soul Oh, my soul, I worship His holy name. Sing like never before. Oh, my soul, I worship Your holy name. Bless the Lord, oh, my soul. Oh, my soul. Worship His holy name Sing like never before Oh my soul I worship Your holy name You're rich in love You're rich in love And you're slow to end Your name is great And your heart for all your goodness I will keep on singing Ten thousand reasons for my heart Sing it again, you're rich in love You're rich in love and don't slow to win Your name is great and your heart is kind for all your goodness, I will keep on singing. Ten thousand reasons for my heart to find. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul. Worship His Sing it again, bless the Lord, bless the Lord, oh my soul, oh my soul, worship Rita la masike, la 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 masike, ne andere le. Oh my soul, I worship your home. Sing your song unto God, sing bless the Lord, bless the Lord. And you can hear me in my Oh, sing like never before. Oh, my soul, I worship your holy name. Bless the Lord, oh, my I will keep worshiping. Oh, I will bless the Lord who is risen. Alive. 
करते रह मेरे मन उसके उपकारों को स्मरण करते रह मेरे मन क्योंकि यहोवा कितना भला है उसकी करुणा सदा की है हाल लोहिया उसकी करुणा सदा की है उसकी करुणा सदा की है इज मर्सी एंड फॉर एवर ओ वी वर्शिप यू डैडी We worship you, our King, our brother, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Holy Spirit. We give you glory, honor, and praise. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Please be seated. Thank you, guys. Turn to your neighbor and say, "I'm so excited to see you." We are so excited to see you. We are so excited to see you. We all make mistakes. I think we we all learn that in the mistakes, who is holding your hands? Christ, and we are going to improve. Amen. Don't you even say my failure is not final. See my mistake is not final. Amen. And I'm not my failure. Don't you even say you are not your failure. You're not your failure. Amen. Hallelujah. I want to welcome all those who are watching us online, many of our students and the families and many people whom we even haven't met. personally are joining us live and i want you all shall we all greet them together yes we welcome you and happy resurrection sunday to all from our from our fellowship from our church see i want to tell you we might be a small group here but the impact that we are producing all over the world is amazing amen because when we receive testimonies across the world from people whom we don't even know see we last week we were in pune and god gave us the opportunity to minister together my wife and i with our children we were in pune for 3 days retreat and uh, there were close to 75 youth and 10 mentors and all together we were 100 people and there were so many people who came and said Sir ma'am we have just heard you online but so happy to see you offline and so eager to hear the word that you guys are declaring from germinate we were so excited we don't know them but the word how the word goes so i want to tell you worship team media team as we are together hosting and carrying the presence of god it is not just for the city of karunya nagar amen it is going all over the world amen hallelujah and god is so good so faithful yes i'm super excited because two of our elder sons are here one has traveled all the way from us to give us a surprise he is doing his ms in us joshua abi uh he graduated 2 years back too Two years back, two years back, and now he's doing his uh, MS in comp- uh, computer science in US. Which city is this? Charlotte, right? Charlotte. And we have been in touch. 
and uh, the lord has been doing so much and he got chance to come to india and as soon as he landed in bombay he told his parents pehle se i have to go to karunya and meet sir and family we really honor you thank you so much for taking our time and coming so i invite joshua to share his testimony how the lord has been leading him and how the lord has blessed him because i remember when he was in final year one of his prayer requests was sir pray pray for my admissions then pray for my visa pray for my finances and when we prayed and sent him there were so many uncertainties kahan jayega kaise rahega kaisa fellowship milega but i want him to tell how the lord has been so faithful hi church um so good to be back here um hi to isha and prayer and sir and ma'am cuz like uh, we been each other since uh, back in college and back when we were here when we started there was no ro- like there was no uh, there was not this is not uh, there were no walls um so good to see all that god is doing in germinate through sir and ma'am um my testimony does not start here in karunya uh, it starts way back in like 2016 um i was born to a like a believing parents always grew up going going to church uh long story short i uh went with the rock group of friends was influenced and i was uh, i was a heavy weed smoker um but god is a god who can break any addiction Amen. anyone here with an addiction um i've seen god work uh for 6 months i could not stop smoking but the way uh, god used people in my life um sir and ma'am are such safe places i had safe places back in mumbai um who accepted me even while i was um uh, smoking and they showed me the love of christ and that's how i came out of it it was one of the biggest miracles in my life and that's when i decided to give my life and uh, give my life to jesus um so even when i came to karunya i in my first year i see all uh, all the it's so good to see uh, god leading our juniors um never gets old <laughs> um yeah so when i was in karunya god uh, in the first year i'm just collecting my thoughts <laughs> um in the first year when i came i was pretty isolated um which is a dangerous place to be in um but god connected me to praise and he's been one of my best friends so pray for just one close friend it'll change your life um and one close mentor so sir and ma'am they have changed my life i thank god for them um throughout karunya uh, what i learned in every stage of my life god has revealed a character of him um that i did know in the past season so if you are uh, if you think you are in a season of lack god will show up as a, as your provider um uh, if you think if you think you are in a season of toil he'll show up as rest uh that's one of my major te- testimonies in karunya i never i always got eight hours of sleep before an exam <laughs> so i would encourage all of y'all to just depend on god especially before your exams and just rest he will show up he will show up um even in my visa process god was with me um the devil will always try to tell you you are not worthy of where you are supposed to be uh but you have to be so conscious of that that's the enemy and that's not your own voice speaking that is the enemy then and god does not sound like that um yeah i had to say a lot of things but i just want to i'm so grateful for this house spirit of the lord is here uh, we are celebrating resurrection sunday and the same spirit that raised jesus from the dead is in each one of you Amen. you all can conquer anything by his blood um i don't know what else I, let me just I want to declare Isaiah 40:31 over your lives. Um but those who trust in the Lord will find new strength. 
They will soar high on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not faint. When you put your whole weight on God, He will never let you be put to shame. Um, so I just wanted to encourage each one of you this morning. Um, just put your whole weight on God. And thank you, sir and ma'am, for discipling us uh, throughout all the years I was in Karunia. Um, so good to see you all again. Thank you. Praise God. So proud of you, Josh, wherever you are. May the Lord prosper you. And God, I think his testimony encourages us, ne? From a weed smoker who was strongly addicted to a place where he's preaching the gospel and he's doing well in his studies. Uh, see, the struggles in life will keep coming and you know, going. But the thing is, the covenantal relationships are the ones that will hold you tight. Yes or no? Yes or no? See, our dream about Germany is to become a covenantal community where we hold each other no matter what. Okay, is it not? All of you here, I know, I have a little bit of data here and But I love you. Okay? If you believe it, then no matter what. If you believe it, then a little bit. But that bad mind will go off. Because as a father, I have to... What? Correct. I want to tell you something. I'm not disappointed in you. I love you. Because that's our duty to mentor you into a place of maturity. Right, Vijay? Right, Judah? Our dear children. See, maturity is a place where you take the position of your father. You know what is maturity? What is maturity? What is maturity? You mature and your father looks at you and says, Yes, now my son will take my position. See, last week we were not here and you all did an amazing job. Organizing, coming together. But I noticed that when, when ma'am and I, we are here, it feels as if sir and ma'am will do everything. So that's why we will be late. That's why we will do the work as much as we have to do. No, sir and ma'am are here, right? See, we are growing into a family. And it's high time that we own the community. Yes or no? Sir, Sunday, Sunday, kyo? Parivar mein agar ye baate nahi karenge, to kaha karenge baate? We are not here to play church. Don't you know, say, we are not here to play? We are not here to play church. We are not here to play church. We are here to become a family which cannot be broken, which stands with each other in the thick and the thin. If we can't do that, then kya ho jata hai? We become like any other, any other traditional organization which is there just for Sunday. Theek hai? Hai ya na? With me? Or without me? Yes, with? And this, is, this dialogue is taken from the movie Night and Day. Kya Tom Cruise bolta hai? Tom Cruise hai na usga na? Hai na Tom Cruise hai na? Come on. With us? Yes? Yes? Chalo khade ho jau yaar ek bar khade ho jau. Khade ho jau. Ek dousre ko jor ke hak kar ke bolo happy resurrection day. Happy resurrection day. Aja ho jau, main bhi khali khada ho. I have to hold the mic. Idhar ha, idhar ha, idhar ha, idhar ha, idhar ha. Come, come, Vijay, here. Here, Jubel, here. Come, come, Vijay, here. Come, 
ഹാലലു ഹാപ്പി റിസറക്ഷൻ ഡേ ഹാപ്പി റിസറക്ഷൻ ഡേ ഓയ് ഉദയ് ഇതരാ ഹാലലുയ പ്രൈസ് ദി ലോർഡ് ലവ് യു ലവ് യു Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Please be seated. Please be seated. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Good to see Hanson. Prezen is also here. Prezen is coming all the way from Bombay. He keeps he, he makes it a point to keep visiting us. at least once in a once in four months or five months at least come present tell us what's happening oh hello everyone uh, it's so good to be back here uh, i i was thinking what to share and uh, i want to share the faithfulness of god uh, with with this germinate family Uh, we we started off very small like as in uh, this was a open roof before this it was just a, a screen it was a, a zoom meeting where we used to meet uh, and i have i want to share the faithfulness of god in uh, how god was faithful to sir faithful to us me josh and so many of us uh, there were times when nobody used to attend uh, like it used to be only five people in the zoom meeting and still sir used to share the word with the same intensity with the same power and used to take care how he is taking care of you all the same way and uh, even josh i want to share how he was faithful in hosting the meetings like even if uh, people would come not come he would be there 10 minutes before he would have the ppt ready he and uh, no maybe uh, we didn't have the limelight or we didn't have the audience like uh, who will watch us appreciate us but we were like a family no matter what uh, we would stick together we uh, if if uh, there were times when if he's out he would keep me in charge if i am out uh, i will keep him accountable for something and i think that's how uh, we have grown and and as i was uh, uh he was sharing just before that uh, this doesn't stay with just with us we pass it on to others so even i i want to share a small testimony about uh, how uh, i was talking to one of my friend in uh, in my company about money and uh, so she was asking me about why don't you own a credit card and i was like e, i have enough so i don't want to own a credit card and i do not hate credit card for disclaimer <laughs> and uh, she was like everybody wants more money and i said okay but i don't want i have enough and uh, she was like but why don't you want more money and i'm like uh, because i have enough and i asked her then ki why do you want money she is like i want to spend i asked her how much do you want she said some amount and i said what if i give you and will you be happy with that she said no and i said uh, that's the thing you do not know your boundaries with money and uh, she was like i never thought about it that way uh, because with credit card she used to keep spending and uh, she's like now i know about uh, i've never thought about this point but thank you for sharing and i think this is all because we learned about these things in community and we pass it on to others and uh god provides for me god whenever i need i do not look at my bank account i look to god and he gives me in so many ways that uh, i'm now not ever doubting him when it comes to money so yeah that's what anybody else wants to share their testimony thank you preeson for bringing your testimony really encouraging thank you aur koi hai anybody wants to testify what the lord has done nahi hai to will jump into the word yes jump into the word bhai mera bible de dega turn with me to first corinthians chapter 
Thank you. Thank you, Jones. Turn with me to 1 Corinthians chapter 15. Yeah. Let's read from verse 12 to 19. Okay? Let's read from verse 12 to 19. Huh? Mm -hmm. hmm. See, if Christ is not risen, then our preaching is in vain and your faith is also empty. See, there is, a, there is an argument that is happening and then Paul is trying to dissolve that argument telling that there is a resurrection of dead. Amen? Because if there is no resurrection of dead, then, then Jesus has not been raised. And if Jesus is not risen, then our faith is empty. See, what I am trying to say is, what happened today is the substance of our faith. What happened today is the substance of our faith. See, and I want you to understand what all things happened today. Take care. Aage padhiye. Padhiye, padhiye, Judah. Yes, and we are found false witnesses of, witnesses of God because we have testified of God that He has raised up Christ, whom He did not raise up, if in fact the dead do not rise. If Christ is not risen, then it makes all of us what? False witnesses. Okay? Now go further. If Christ is not raised from the dead, then your faith is futile. What is the meaning of futile? Huh? Useless. First it said empty. Then it says useless and then it says you are still in your sins if Christ is not raised from the dead we are still in our sins then also those who have fallen asleep in Christ have perished if Christ is not risen from the dead then all those who have died they have perished Matlab, once dead that means gone and there is uske baad koi hope nahi hai now look at this. If in this life only we have hope in Christ, then we are of all men the most pitiable. But go to the next verse. But now, hallelujah. See, all these things are written for us to understand that Christ is risen from the dead. How many of you say that your faith is not futile, but your faith has got a substance? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. See, the very nature of faith is to believe that Christ is risen from the dead. Amen. Hallelujah. I, I will try to explain these things to you for you to, exp to understand and go further and, and just read this. But now Christ is risen from the dead and has become the first fruits of those who have fallen asleep. For since by... Man came death, by one man also came the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all die, even so in Christ all shall be made alive. But each one in his own order, Christ the first fruits, afterward those who are Christ at his coming. See, okay. Now listen to me. Christ, our Christ, our picture of Christ has to expand. Take a samaj me aare. Our picture of Christ and resurrection has to expand today. Because what happened to Christ was not a local event. It was not a time bound event. What happened to Christ happened to the cosmos. What happened to Christ has an eternal effect. How many of you are able to get it? What happened to Christ has 
a global, a cosmic effect, not just global effect, but a cosmic effect. What has happened to Christ is not something which is time bound to 1st AD or to the time of the Romans. No, what has happened to Christ has happened in an eternal spirit which, which connects people from all time frame, past, present and future. Are you with me? See, our view about Christ is many times it's limited. Okay? But I pray that today we will have a expanded view of our Jesus. Who is this Jesus? Okay? Go with me. Come with me. I will tell scriptures I want you to read. And this will expand your view about Christ. Okay? Who is Christ? John chapter 1 verse 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Adi me. वचन था वचन परमेश्वर के साथ था और वचन परमेश्वर था और जो कुछ भी उत्पन्न हुआ किसके द्वारा उत्पन्न हुआ वचन के द्वारा ही उत्पन्न हुआ कम ऑन रीड इट इन इंग्लिश इन द बिगिनिंग वाज द कम ऑन रीड इट टुगेदर लाउडली इन द बिगिनिंग वाज द वर्ड एंड द वर्ड वाज विद गॉड एंड एंड द वर्ड वाज गॉड एंड एवरीथिंग दैट हैज बीन क्रिएटेड कम ऑन were made through him and without him nothing made that was made in him was life and the life was the light of all men and the light shines in the darkness and the darkness did not comprehend who is your jesus and my jesus did he exist before he became jesus the carpenter Yes, from the beginning, before the beginning began, who was there? Jesus. Before the beginning began, God began the beginning. That's why he is God. Before the beginning began in Genesis 1, 1, who was there? Who was there? That's what you read about Jesus. In the beginning was the word. He was with God. And everything that is created has been created through the word. Okay, itna. Samaj mein Let's go to Colossians chapter 1. Okay, let's, let's, let's do some parallel studies and see how big my Jesus is. Everybody say, my Jesus is a cosmic Christ. Okay, huh? see, our view of Christ, jo hai aaj, aaj humko usko expand karke bolna hai ki my Jesus is not a local Jesus, but he is a cosmic Christ. He's an eternal, immortal, invincible God. Colossians chapter 1, go to verse 16. Aye, 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 aye. 15 say, everybody, are you all here? Colossians chapter 1, verse 15. Yes. Let the view of Christ in us expand in Jesus' name. Look at this. He is the He is the image of the invisible God he is the image he is the image of the invisible God then the firstborn over all creation now read now read for by him all things were created that are in heaven and that are on earth visible and invisible whether thrones or dominions, or principalities, or powers, all things were created through him and for him. Hallelujah. Seen, unseen. Powers, principalities, dominions, everything was created. Kiske liye? For him and through him. How many of you are getting it? What is the raw material that God used to create the everything, seen and unseen? Jesus. Hallelujah. What was it created for? Jesus. Samaj me hai? Now go further. This will shock you. Yes? This will shock you. Go further. And he is before all things. Before Lucifer. Before 
humans before anything who was there who is there tell me christ has always been there and <laughs> in him in him in him all things consist chavla bhai aaiye hamare group mein he is tall and handsome he can represent all of us theek hai nahi jubel se lamba hai ye pata nahi theek hai tere ko next time bulayenge theek hai ye jesus hai theek hai in him all things consist what do you mean by that see this is he is representing jesus everything was created for him through him and everything consists where is the solar system then talk to me where are the angels where is everything created and uncreated are you all able to get it pause i am not preaching something new what is it what is written everything was created for him through him and everything consists in him and then read further and he is the head of the body the church who is the beginning the first born from the dead that in all things he may have the preeminence see he is the one who holds everything together see the scientists they are confused there is a powerful repulsive force inside the atom but why everything is not just collapsing or disintegrating why the planets are in its orbit why do you tell me the answer who is holding it together it consists in him and he holds everything together thank you who is holding you right now talk to me who is holding that tree which is outside and the mountain which you see and admire who is holding it together talk to me समझ में आ रहा है सीन एन अंस सो कैन यू सी दिस जीसस इज बिगर देन आर इमेजिनेशन कम विद मी एंड थिंक ओवर इट इन द बिगनिंग वॉज द वर्ड द वर्ड वॉज विद गॉड एंड द वर्ड वॉज गॉड एवरीथिंग दैट इज क्रिएटेड सीन एंड अनसीन हैज बीन क्रिएटेड फॉर हिम थ्रू हिम कंसिस्ट इन हिम एंड ही इज द वन हु इज होल्डिंग इट टूगेदर हु इज दिस the word who is this the word who is this the word who is this the word i want you to get this now go to hebrews chapter 1 theek hai let's draw some parallels and see that my jesus is is a cosmic christ hai na is a cosmic christ he is not somebody who is local or time bound a famous historian who came and just vanished off no he is relevant here now the very reason you are existing and you are not disintegrating into pieces is because he is holding you by his power padhiye now read this everybody everybody read it together loudly god who at various times and in various ways spoke in time past to the fathers by the prophets has in these last days spoken to us by his son theek hai now read whom he has appointed heir of all things through whom also he made the worlds the worlds were made through whom jesus who being the brightness of his glory who is the brightness of the glory of god jesus and the express image of his person see it would have been enough to say the image of his person but it says express image he is the express image of the father that means whatever is in the trinity who is the express image of the triune god talk to me jesus aage padhiye 
and upholding upholding all things by the word of his power when he had by himself purged our sins sat down at the right hand of the majesty on high having become so much better than the angels he has by inheritance obtained a more excellent name than they are you all with me who is jesus now tell me talk to me who is this jesus who is this jesus the express image of the father colossians chapter 1 says in him the fullness of god dwells bodily in him the fullness of god dwells bodily take i'll explain janish come 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 hana come i'll explain to you a few things ready to learn turn to your neighbor who is sleeping just wake them up and say please get up utho 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 acha come okay father son and the holy spirit theek hai father son and the holy spirit see man and woman have come from god our god has masculine and the feminine nature see god is a father and he is also a nourishing mother that's why his name is el shaddai you see his him taking vengeance against the gods of egypt as a protector and defender nahi right? in the wilderness you see him as a mother nourishing these children in the wilderness with the manna with the water from the rock so you need to understand why i have included hana because in the triune god you have both what the masculine and the feminine nature so men are not from mars and you know women are not from jupiter they all have come from say the triune god triune god okay so now who is the sun jesus in the beginning was the word and the word was with god and the word thoda smile karte rehna beech beech mein theek hai hai na theek hai smile karte rehna okay ready okay so everything was created for whom who is the darling here jesus there is no competition in this family they are love ek dusre ke upar love is showered it's an other centered love hath pakdoge हाथ पकड़ो इसका हाथ पकड़ो चावला ठीक है इट्स एन अदर सेंटर लव थोड़ा सा हंस के घूमते हुए जाओ यस व्हाट इज दिस ट्रायून गॉड ठीक है एवरीथिंग एग्जिस्ट इनसाइड दिस गॉड यस और नो यस और नो नाउ लुक लुक एट दिस लव ओके द होल क्रिएशन प्लान केम फॉर होम किसके लिए आया सन के लिए आया ठीक है the son who is in the bosom of the father has come to reveal the the triune god who is the express image of the father who is the express image of god the unseen god jesus itna samajh mein aa raha hai theek hai now why creation humko kyon banaya fir have you ever thought of it why did god create us what was the pre creation purpose kabhi socha hai humko kyon banaya हमें इसलिए बनाया कि स्वर्ग में वेकेंसी था कौन गिर गया लूसीफर गिर गया अब वर्शिप लीडर नहीं है तो किसको चाहिए अब जुड़ा चाहिए सुजित चाहिए वर्शिप लीडर चाहिए क्रिस्टीना चाहिए क्यों चाहिए इसलिए बनाया नहीं गो 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 री डिफिशियन चैप्टर वन यू विल अंडरस्टैंड द प्री क्रिएशन पर्पज वाई यू एंड आई आर क्रिएटेड वाई यू एंड आई आर क्रिएटेड ठीक है आप लोग ठीक हो यस खुश हो Yes. So now see why did God create? Padi Ephesians chapter one, verse three onwards. Ephesians chapter one, verse three onwards. Yeah. Yeah. Look at yes. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Fourth verse. He. Everybody say he chose us in. look at this i'm talking to you about the pre creation we were chosen in whom in in jesus 
we were chosen in him then before the foundation of the world that we should be holy and without blame before him in love having predestined us to the adoption as sons by Jesus Christ now look at this why are we created talk to me why are we created why are we created we are created to be adopted into the family of God this word adoption is not like apna adopting a child from orphanage no this is not the term this is a term where the whole idea of God is to mature us into the image of the son to mature us in the image of the son where you look exactly like the son before the creation are you all with me who chose us he chose us in in Christ to be called as holy and blameless you are chosen in Christ holy and blameless you are all chosen in Christ holy and blameless you are all chosen in Christ holy and blameless we were all chosen in Christ this has been the purpose of God from the beginning before the fall happened what was the purpose of God what was the purpose of God to have you and me pakdi pakdi i am representing all of us to have you and me inside what inside this family where you can see the father as jesus sees the father where you can have the connection with the holy spirit just like how jesus has the connection how many of you are getting my point yes or no so now god created adam and eve yes but adam and eve they sinned so we were created in the image of god see what is the image when you stand in front of the mirror what does the mirror mirror give you what does the mirror give you your image yes or no so when you move what moves when you move what moves the image just imagine when i have turned my back theek hai if i am inclined in a different angle image nahi aayega yes or no see we were created in the image of god for a face to face relationship just like how jesus has a face to face the moment sin entered what happened the sin started producing distortion what is a distortion what is a distortion produce started produ producing a manipulation where the man who is created in the image of god started shifting his focus from the living god from where i derive my identity from whom i derive the source of my life i started shifting are you all able to get it so when adam and eve fell who fell the whole creation was subjected to the fall of adam and who is the rightful owner of heaven and earth sorry earth adam and eve yes or no god gave the earth and everything created and he said have dominion the moment adam and eve fell what fell the creation fell but praise the lord the plan of god did not change the plan of god did not change who came who came jesus who came jesus he stepped into my mess he stepped into this visible world see who he existed as the word as the spirit before the before he became man yes or no who is jesus the one who holds everything together everything he has created okay now when he became human you need to understand that he is bringing the god world into our world theek hai is bringing the god world into our world come newton come aap log thoda sa udhar jaake jaiye khade ho jaiye i'll come andrew come turn that side come 
Samyakam. You turn that side. Come. Turn that side. Ab aisa act karo ki you are in, a, in the darkness. Your eyes are totally closed. If I had, you know, bands, I would have... Close your eyes. Huh? Ab andhe jaisa act karo. Take a huh, take a now wait. Take a samaj me aga? Okay. Ah, ruko, ruko, ruk. Stop. Statue. Now look at this, look at this. Jesus became what? Human and he entered our darkness. I want you to get it. When we fell into sin, we started thinking that this God is against me. He entered into our darkness. And I want you to get it. He started reconciling us in our darkness. Hey, aake khol. Aake khol. Kon aagya hai? I am here to reconcile you telling that you are part of my family. Hug him. You have become part of my family. Now see, Jesus is entering into our darkness. See, on the cross, on the cross, he could feel the extreme darkness in all this human mess, in the sinful mess. As Jesus is entering, he could feel the darkness. In those moments of darkness, you know what he's bringing? He's, the rev he's bringing the revelation of the Father and the Spirit. Aye, aye, aye. How many of you are getting what I'm trying to say? See, in the incarnation, God is entering into my darkness step by step by step by step. That's why the word of God says, He grew inside my skin. But who is He? He's the one who is holding the universe together. Who is holding the universe together? Jesus. So He's stepping into my darkness and step by step He's reconciling everything to whom? To the Father, to the Spirit, to this Triune family. How many of you are getting? Did I confuse you? Did I confuse you? No. He's entering into this darkness, my darkness, your darkness, into the corruption of the whole universe and the cosmos. And what is he doing? He's bringing the love of the Father, love of the Spirit into our darkness. On the cross of Calvary, talk to me. On the cross of Calvary, the, the, the darkness was the thickest. The darkness was the thickest. Where every ounce of us wanted to kill him. Come, crucify him. Come, Swami, you are here. Everyone, men have not done it. Everyone has done it. Everyone has done it. Everyone has done it. Everyone has done it. Take the, take the spear. Huh. See, now look at this. Now look at this. What is happening? What is happening? What is happening? This is the darkest moment inside the human history where what is happening? We crucified the sun in our darkest moment where we couldn't, re couldn't understand this God. In that darkest moment, He reconciled us to the Father. I want you to read 2 Corinthians chapter 5. Verse 17 to 21. Look at Jesus on the cross. What was happening? Last three verses, padhi, 18, 19, 20, 21. Padhi. Now all things are of God. Who has reconciled us? What do you mean by reconciled? What is reconciled? See, come, come. Come here. Newton come here. What is reconciliation? Ye dono apas mein? What is reconciliation? Dono ko? Mila dena. In our case, God has never forsaken us. He has never turned his back. But who has turned the back? The humans have turned their back. But who has been running through the history? Who has been running? The triune God has been running to bring forth the son so that the son who is the express image of God can reveal the heart of the father. Ki from the beginning, hamari icha kya thi? Ki you become part of our family. family. Hallelujah. Are you all getting it? Are you all getting it? And on the cross, what happened? Aage padhi? 
What way? That God was in Christ reconciling the the world to himself. Now look at this. We are the world. Okay? Cross. The father. Eve. Come here. Who is reconciling us to God himself? Who is Christ? Can you see what happened on the cross of Calvary? He is reconciling. Come, 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 come. We are not against you. Because of the sin, we have not changed our plan. From beginning, what was the plan? To adopt you into the family. From the beginning, the, 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 the pre-creation purpose has been to adopt you into the family. And that cry of reconciliation was loud and clear on the cross of Calvary. Itna you all know. Yes or no? But what happened on, on, in the resurrection? What happened on the day of resurrection? See, I told you, if Jesus wouldn't have raised from the dead, we would have been still in our sin. But everything shifted when Jesus rose again. Hallelujah. Everything shifted when Jesus rose again. So who is this Jesus? Is he just the son of the carpenter or who is he? Bataye. Who is he? Who is he? The express image of God, the one who holds the, the whole created and uncreated world inside of him. So whatever is happening to Jesus is happening to whom? Talk to me. It's happening to whom? The cosmos. To the cosmos. Now go to Ephesians chapter 4. And read from verse 20. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Just Janice, you stay. Ephesians chapter 4. Padie, I hope you are able to get it what I am trying to communicate. But that is not the way you learn Christ. Hmm. Seven and I'm going to tell you what happened on the resurrection day. Yeah, look at this. Seven se padhiye. But grace was given to each one of us according to the measure of Christ's gift. Therefore he says, when he ascended on high, look at this. When he ascended on high, he led the captivity captive and give give gifts to men see when jesus rose again look at this when jesus rose again and as he ascended what did he do what did he do he took the captivity captive yani ki shaitan ko the darkness of sin, everything that was holding the human race and the whole universe under the captivity, he made them captive. He made the captivity captive. Go to Colossians chapter 2, verse 15. He made the captivity captive. He made the captivity captive. But he Having disarmed principalities, powers, he made a public spectacle of the enemy, triumphing over them. What? In it. Hallelujah. Look at me. Look at me. Everything that held us captive, who made that captivity captive? Jesus. He stripped the enemy of his power. He stripped the enemy of his authority. Through his death, his, he destroyed the power of the enemy. And as he ascended, he made the captivity captive. And he gave gifts to all men. And he filled everything with himself. He filled 
everything with himself filled everything with himself filled everything with himself now you tell me has jesus solved the sin problem or not has jesus solved the sin problem or not are we forever reconciled in jesus or not talk to me are we forever reconciled or not yes we have been included in this life read colossians chapter 3 verse 1 Colossians chapter 3 verse 1. See our Jesus is a cosmic Jesus. And whatever happened to Jesus happened to us. It happened to the creation. And the gospel is that the power of Jesus. His resurrection power has resurrected us with him. Read Colossians chapter 3 verse 1. If then you have been raised with Christ. Read the same verse in message translation. Read it. It says, Christ's resurrection is our resurrection. Message, message, message. Pehla wala. Yeah, read. So if you are serious about living this new resurrection life with Christ. <coughs> now tell me, on this day, when Jesus rose again from the dead, what happened to you and me? Talk to me. What happened to you and me? Talk to me. What happened to you and me? On this day, when Jesus rose again, what happened to you and me? Kya hua? Hamare saath kya hua? What happened? We rose with him. Correct. Go to Romans chapter 6. Go to Romans chapter 6. Read verse 4, 5, 6 and 7. See, see, we need to connect these things and Judah was rightly telling it's time for us to meditate and meditate and meditate and meditate so that it becomes part of our system. It's part of our system. You understand that this king, this king of kings and the lord of lords, this is your lord and my lord and he is the lord of the seen and the unseen. Hallelujah. Usse badkar aur koi hai nahi. And uske punaruthan mein kya hua? We were included. The earth was included. The cosmos was included. And the sting of death which is sin and the power of sin which is the law everything was removed from the way so that we can understand and live this resurrection life look at this therefore read with me therefore we were buried with him through baptism into death that just as everybody say just as Christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the Father, even so, we also should walk in the newness of life. Turn to your neighbor and say, I'm free. I am free to walk in the newness of life. To walk in the newness of life. To walk in the newness of life. Hallelujah. Come, come. Father, Son and the Holy Spirit, come. See, when Jesus died, who died? We died and the whole, the creation that was affected by the sin died. When Jesus rose again, who rose again? Are you all able to get it? Who is this Jesus? He's bringing the, the triune God into the humanity, bringing the triune God and the light of God into the human darkness inside the sin and on the cross of Calvary he defeated the darkness and as he rose again look at this he filled everything with the light of his power are you all getting it? are you all get, getting it? because of one man Adam ke sin ke chalte what came? we all believe in a universal fall yes or no? because Adam sinned who fell? Talk to me. Talk to me. Uday come. Because Adam sinned. How did you and I become sinners? Because who sinned? Our great grand Apachan who sinned? Adam 
sinned. Because Adam sinned, who fell? You and I, who are born as the human race, as the great grandchildren of Adam, who fell? We all fell. And because of Adam's sin, the whole creation got affected. Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes. Now look at this. The last Adam. Now, now I want you to have a comparison. The first Adam. And who is the last Adam? Because of one man, what came? Sin and death and corruption. Okay? Because of the last Adam, what came? Life, resurrection and glory. Hallelujah. Because of one man, what got affected? The whole human race and the entire creation got affected. Yes or no? We all believe in a universal fall. Yes or no? Yes or no? But today, I want you to understand that there is a cosmic effect of resurrection. Hallelujah. That covers every sphere of life. I don't know if you are excited. I am super excited because this Jesus, my Jesus, your Jesus is not some, somebody normal or local or you know time bound. No, he is the God of the seen and the unseen and all that has happened to Jesus has happened to you and me. The power of sin is broken and you have been brought, thanks, thanks to that, into the newness of life. Hold me together. We have been brought into the newness of life. What is this newness of life? You have the permission to see the father as who sees? Jesus. You have the permission to have connection with the Holy Spirit just like how, how who has? Jesus. You have the permission to live the resurrection life. I want to tell you today. The more we set our mind on these things. Go to Colossians chapter 3. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So sweet of you. Thank you. Thank you, Chavla. Thank you, Anna. Go to Colossians chapter 3. Why am I trying to strain myself to teach you and to put this into your head? Why? Colossians chapter 3, now read verse 1 onwards. Everybody together. Everybody stand up wherever you are and let's read it together. See, today we are celebrating Resurrection Day. But we need to understand that this is not an event that happened in the past. This has affected you and me and it has affected the creation. Amen. Every time you come together and declare Jesus, we need to understand that He is powerful, He is glorious, He is majestic. Everybody read. All of you, could you all look at the screen and read? If... If then you were raised with Christ, seek those things which are above. Where is Christ? Where Christ is? Sitting at the right hand of God. Set your mind on things above, not on the things on the earth. What do you mean by that? Ab hame, we don't have to look down. We don't have to be slaves to sin. We don't have to be slaves to sickness and disease and to the worldly things. We have been made, what? Equal. In the sense, we have been raised up, brought into a place where you can have communion with God. And now today God is telling, since you have been raised to life with Christ, set your mind on. Things. How many of you are worried about your future? About the things, kaise hoga, kya hoga. That means what are we doing? We are setting our minds on the worldly philosophies, the worldly perspectives. But the Lord is telling, hey, chin up. Turn to your neighbor and say, chin up. Hey, chin up. Hallelujah. You have been raised to a new life where Jesus is. So who is the Lord of all? Who is the Lord of Talk to me. Who is the Lord of all? See, look at this. When you understand that your Jesus is a cosmic Jesus and you have the privilege to call him your brother, when you have the permission to call him Abba Father, when you have the same spirit by which you call out Abba Father, aapka aur mera stand kaisa hoga? 
कैसा होना चाहिए कैसा होना चाहिए वरिड ड्रूपिंग ट्रबल्ड बाय एवरी न्यूज वॉट शुड बी वॉट शुड बी आर हमारा एटीट्यूड क्या होना चाहिए क्या आई विल टेल माई डैडी आई विल प्रे इन द नेम ऑफ जीसस एंड एवरीथिंग विल शिफ्ट हाल लोहिया दैट्स वाई द वर्ड ऑफ गॉड सेज वी हैव बिन गिवन अ नेम विच इज अबव every other name that in the name of jesus every knee shall bow and every tongue should confess that jesus christ is the lord hallelujah hallelujah look at this for you died and your life is hidden with christ in god when christ he who is your life appears you will also appear with him in glory therefore put to death your members which are on earth fornication uncleanness passion evil desire covetousness which is idolatry and you see that you have permission to put to death all that thing that has been holding you captive amen why because jesus is alive that resurrection power is in you the power of death is broken the fear of death is broken hallelujah the fear of separation is broken the fear that used to bring that no i am an orphan and i don't have an inheritance is broken because jesus has fulfilled the plan of god by bringing you in resurrecting you with christ and telling that hey my resurrection is whose resurrection my resurrection is your resurrection hallelujah we are not under the sentence of death anymore turn to your neighbor and say you are not under the sentence of death anymore you are not we are not under the sentence of death anymore we have an instruction to preach the gospel to all talk to me jesus after he rose again he came to his disciples and said preach the gospel to all creation Matthew 28 verse 18 to 19 if you read it says preach the gospel to all creation who is holding the gospel inside now we have experienced the gospel we have an we have a responsibility to preach the gospel to the humans and also to the creation What do you mean by preaching the gospel to the creation? Talk to me. Talk to me. When you go to a land, when you go to a city, look at the environment, not just the people. You tell the people the gospel, but who also has to hear the gospel? The trees, the created things who is lord who is lord jesus is the lord see when you see i, I have heard so many testimonies when people entered up when the believers went to a place where the water was poisonous where the environment was so dry they started declaring the gospel to the creation and what happened the environment started shifting the water became fine so that people can use it the death was removed from the water in the land and the land started producing crop why because people they understood that i have a responsibility to preach the gospel to the to the creation see creation has been included in the resurrection kitne logo ko samajh mein aa raha hai see when you go to the company when you go to a new city preach the gospel what is the gospel what is the gospel hey jesus entered into our mess he has turned everything around so rejoice rejoice you stars you planets you you trees rejoice you rejoice who has risen jesus it affects everything 
I pray that the Holy Spirit will help you to understand this. Set your mind. Set your mind on things above and see that Jesus is seated above all. He is the one who is holding everything together. And he has given you and I the authority to use this name. Set your mind on things above where Christ is. He is in you. He is living and breathing in you. Things can shift when we start understanding that this resurrection power is inside of you. The greatest demonstration of God's power happened when God raised Jesus from the dead. Because you need to understand that when Jesus rose again from the dead, the entire cosmos which was affected by the virus of sin was delivered. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's why you see the greatest demonstration of power happened when Jesus was raised from the dead. And the word of God says in Ephesians chapter 1, that same resurrection power now lives inside us. Touch yourself and say the same resurrection power. The same resurrection power lives on the inside of me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's pray that Lord, let the rivers of living waters flow through me. Let this gospel of Christ be preached to all creation. I want to preach. Today we have a responsibility to preach the gospel that you are free. I want to tell you today, if you have been experiencing some bondages, I want to tell you something. That captivity has been made captive. That captivity has been made captive. Whatever. Is it, is it some witchcraft with which your family is struggling? Is it some spell or some sickness or something that you see is not leaving you? Like how Joshua was telling. There was a habit. There was an addiction that was choking him. But Christ, the king, has made that captivity as captive. Whatever, whatever has been holding us captive, the Lord Jesus has taken that thing and made it captive. Matlab, jo hume gulam banata tha, usko kisko usne kya kya usko? Gulam jisne hume banaya tha, usi ko kya kar diya? Gulam bana diya. Hallelujah. Who has the final say? Jesus has the final say. Amen. That's why we have authority when we pray. When you pray, when you connect with the resurrection power, everything can be shifted. Let's all lift up our voices and declare thanks to this God. What a beautiful plan of salvation where you and I are included. In this resurrection life, where Jesus entered, everything in the cosmos that was affected, He has brought His resurrection life and brought His healing touch on everything. What happened to Jesus happened to the whole cosmos. That's why we have received this message of reconciliation. Things seen and unseen have been reconciled. Hallelujah. Every fragment of the creation which was out of order. Every, everything of the creation which, which was out of order has been brought into the divine order. Hallelujah. But how do you see that happening or coming into reality when you start preaching the gospel? Hallelujah. Declare the gospel. Jesus is alive. Lift up your voice. Let the redeemed of the Lord say, I am redeemed. Let the redeemed of the Lord say, So I am redeemed. I am resurrected. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you for what a, what a plan of salvation that we are delivered. Those who were sitting under the power of the darkness, they have seen light. 
this light is jesus this light is jesus this light is jesus this light is jesus we worship you lord don't you think our king deserves worship our king deserves praise thank you jesus i come before you today and there's just one thing that i want to say thank you lord thank you lord for all you've given to me for all the blessings that i cannot see thank you lord i just want to say thank you lord with a grateful heart with a song of praise with an outstretched arm i bless your name thank you lord i just want to thank you lord thank you lord i just want to thank you lord thank you lord you took my guilt and my shame you took my guilt and my shame You took my sickness and healed all my pain. Thank you, Lord. Say thank you. Thank you, Lord. With a grateful heart, with a song of praise, with an outstretched arm, I bless your name. Thank you, Lord. I just want to thank you Lord Thank you Lord I just want to thank you Lord Thank you Lord We lift you up We lift you up lift you up on our praise we lift you up we lift you up we lift you up on our praise we lift you up we lift you up we lift you up we lift you up on our praise we lift you up we lift you up we lift you up lift you up on our praise Lord as we lift you up in this place you are the king of the universe you are the lord of our lives and we give ourselves to you as we celebrate this resurrection day we declare that we are alive in Christ dead to sin hallelujah and the creation rejoices as we speak this gospel that jesus is alive and you are included in it you are not subjected to the sin and the curse of sin anymore hallelujah now you are subjected to the life and the abundance and the blessing of god hallelujah thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus with a grateful heart with a song of praise with an outstretched arm i bless your name thank you lord i just want to thank you lord you lord i just want to thank you lord thank you lord as we are standing in the presence of god Let's take part in the communion and let's declare. Sir, help me. Chawla. 
Hanna, Christina, can you please help? This is the covenant meal as we meditated on Good Friday. Which says that the work of God is complete. He has included it, us in his life. And when we see the body and the blood of Jesus. We declare and we believe and we see. That we are included in the very life of Jesus. He was wounded. He was broken. He was crushed. He became our sin offering. But as he was going through that gruesome crushing, as he entered the darkness, he reconciled us to the Father. Through his blood which says you are forgiven. Through his body which says that you are healed, you are delivered. You are not under the curse of Adam anymore. Wow. As we declare, Christina, as we declare blessing upon the body and the blood of Jesus, let's see that the curse of Adam has been completely removed. Shall we all stretch out our hands towards the body and the blood of Jesus? Towards these elements of communion and declare, Thank you Jesus for setting me from the power of darkness. Thank you for redeeming me from the curse of Adam. Thank you for setting me, from, setting me free from the, the fear of death. From the dominion of death. We receive life as we eat the body and the blood of Jesus, we are eating the very resurrection life of Jesus. Hallelujah. And together we celebrate this resurrection life. That everything in us catches life as we celebrate the body and the blood of Jesus. Thank you Lord Jesus for your sacrifice. Thank you for your resurrection. Thank you for the pouring, for the outpouring of the Spirit. Thank you for making us the temple. We give you glory in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's take part in communion. Let's rejoice. Tumsa koi nahi तुम सा कहीं नहीं अब है पूरा यकीन तुम सा कहीं नहीं तुम सा कोई नहीं तुम सा कहीं नहीं अब है पूरा यकीन तुम सा कोई
part together and let's thank God and as you are eating the resurrection life is flowing in your body I declare health and wholeness those of you who are joining us online I request you to take part in communion wherever you are and be healed right now as you are taking part in his resurrection life the power of death is broken I declare that every sentence of death from your body, from your family, from your finances, in relationships, I declare that the resurrection life is flowing right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We declare this resurrection life is flowing in our community, in our city, because Jesus is alive. Amen. Hallelujah. You are forgiven. You are reconciled. Restored. Thank you Jesus. 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 There is only one tomb which is empty. And that is the tomb of Jesus. Amen. You know when Jesus rose again, if you read this incident in the gospel, you will find that many saints rose again. They walked around the cities. They met their loved ones and said, hey, hi. Can you imagine? Your great grandfather who is dead knocking at your door. See, we are on the way with Jesus, but we wanted to say hi. Kaisa lagega? They would have been shocked. But the graves were opened. Hallelujah. See, there is hope. There is hope. Praise God. Why? Because the sentence of death has been removed. Amen. And as Jesus is so are we in this world. We have dominion and power. Anand ki? Varpuri. Hallelujah. So we'll sing, we'll dance, we'll worship as they lead us in the singing. Chale? We'll take offering. Yes. Psalm lead karega. Sing karega. Anand ki Varpuri. Yeah, let's all join Psalm as he sings. Come. जीवन है तेरा प्रभु जी तू ही राज करे हो तेरी मर्जी ये जीवन है तेरा प्रभु जी तू ही राज करे हो तेरी मर्जी संग तेरे हम गाते जाए आए मुसीबत मुस्कुराए संग तेरे हम गाते जाए आए मुसीबत मुस्कुराए हे तेरे पवन में आनंद की भरपूर है यीशु तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि है तेरे पवन में आनंद की भरपूर है, 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 है। यीशु तू संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि है क्रूस पर सब हुई समाधि हारा शैता मेरी पापों से मोहते क्रूस पर सब हुई समाधि हारा शैता मेरी पापों से मोहते तेरी मौत से मिली है आजादी 
रोग से गेना हमसे अब कोई शांति तेरी मौत से मिली है आजादी रोग से गेना हमसे अब कोई शांति तेरे भवन में आनंद की भरपूर है यीशु तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि तेरे भवन में आनंद की भरपूर है यीशु तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि है भरपूरी भरपूरी आनंद की भरपूरी भरपूरी आनंद की भरपूरी भरपूरी संतुष्टि यीशु में संतुष्टि 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 यीशु में संतुष्टि ओ भरपूरी भरपूरी आनंद की भरपूरी 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 आनंद की भरपूरी संतुष्टि संतुष्टि यीशु में संतुष्टि 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 यीशु में संतुष्टि मेरा प्यारा उमड़ उमड़ के भरे खुशी से भरे मेरा प्याला उमड़ उमड़ के भरे मेरा जीवन ये शुद्ध खुशी से भरे तेरे भवन में आनंद की भरपूरी तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि तेरे भवन में आनंद की भरपूरी तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि तेरे भवन में आनंद की भरपूरी है यीशु तो संग तो यीशु तो संग तो यीशु तो संग तो जीवन में संतुष्टि है आइए हम प्रार्थना करें धन्यवाद 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 प्रभु यीशु मसीह सेनाओं के यह परमेश्वर आपको धन्यवाद करते हैं कि आप हमें इस जगह पे वापस लाए प्रभु यीश मसीह प्रभु यीश मसीह आप ने प्रभु यीश मसीह हमें हमें एक वचन दिया प्रभु यीश मसीह धन्यवाद करते हैं हर एक आशीष की जो आपने हमको दी प्रभु यीश मसीह इस वक्त हम प्रार्थना करते हैं प्रभु यीश मसीह ऑफरिंग के लिए प्रभु यीश मसीह जिन जिन हाथों ने ये ऑफरिंग दी है प्रभु यीश मसीह उनको आप भरपूरी से प्रभु यीश मसीह भरिए प्रभु यीश मसीह उनके उनको किसी चीज़ की चीज़ की कोई कमी ना रहने पाए प्रभु यीश मसीह इस वक्त हम प्रार्थना करते हैं प्रभु यीश मसीह जबकि अभी हम यहाँ से जाने वाले हैं प्रभु यीश मसीह हम लोगों के सबके साथ होना और जो भी हमारी कठिनाइयों में हमारा हमारी मदद करना प्रभु यीश मसीह और हम हम प्रार्थना करते हैं जो लोग यहाँ पर मौजूद नहीं हैं प्रभु यीश मसीह उन सब की भी साथ होना उन सबको भी अपनी आशीष और शांति देना ये प्रार्थना मांगता हूँ कि प्यारे बेटे यीशु मसीह के नाम से आमिन मे द ग्रेस ऑफ आर लॉर्ड सेवियर जीस क्राइस्ट द लव ऑफ द फादर एंड द स्वीट कमिन ऑफ द होली स्पिरिट बी विथ दी ऑल एमैन प्रेज द लॉर्ड गॉड ब्लेस यू I think next week, या फिर next to next week, we are planning the farewell service for the final years. So once they are back, I think tomorrow most of them are coming. So we will let you know. When is the आपका review कब है? Final review कब है? Seventeen to twenty fourth, ना? उसके बीच में अपन कर कर सकते हैं ना? है ना? वट अबाउट नेक्स्ट वीक कर सकते हैं क्या फेयरवेल नेक्स्ट वीक करें कि उसके बाद वाला नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट वीक के सेवेंथ ना सेवेंथ के बाद फोर्टीन कब है 
एट टू फिफ्टीन कब खत्म होगा इंटरनल एग्जाम फिफ्टींथ फिफ्टींथ इज संडे कि सैटरडे मंडे है एट्थ मंडे क्या ये लास्ट इंटरनल आपके लिए बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट